Hello guys and welcome. This is Rick Utzer with Aragon Web and Aragon Web TV. I apologize for my voice. It's a little rough around the edges today. Real quick, I want to talk to you guys about the Umarex Throttle. Now, we heard rumors of this product uh, back last SHOT Show and it took them a while to get this out. This is an Umarex product. It has the new Stop Shocks shock absorption system in there. We'll get to that in just a second. Uh, they wanted to make sure it was right, so they took their time, they released it, and I'm really glad to finally get my hands on this. I've had this for a while, been trying to get a video out, but boy, in between weather and everything else going on, it's been tough to get done. Uh, this is just a quick, quick look. This is not going to be a full review, so you know, bear with me on that. But I did want to sort of show this to you guys because it's pretty cool. And this gun is actually on its way out. It's going to our guide from our hunt there in Bivens, Texas. Uh, Wyatt, this gun's coming to you. I, I'm sorry it's taking me so long, but uh, we're gonna get this boxed up and get this out to you. Leave on FedEx on Tuesday or Wednesday. Anyway, so I wanted to take a little time and talk to you guys about this particular rifle. It's your standard, you know, 22 cal, comes 122, 177, has a decent scope, three to nine by 32 looks like. Yeah, three to nine by 32 with an adjustable objective, duplex reticle. What sets us apart is the Stop Shocks shock absorption system. Now what happens is when you fire the gun, it absorbs the recoil this way, and then when the piston hits up front, it actually absorbs the other way. So you get recoil absorption in both directions, which I think is pretty cool. You know, that allows the action to move around without, hopefully, without impacting your shot nearly as much. Now, what I want to do today, I want to take my shooting stick and actually shoot right off my sticks to see what kind of accuracy we can get at around 20 yards. Now, pellet choice for this, I'm gonna recommend you look at like the 14 to 15 grain pellets. They seem to be the most consistent. When I go heavier, they tend to spread out. So I know if you guys, you hunters out there wanna run those 21 grain or really super heavy pellets, uh, they're probably not gonna work out well for you. Just stick to the 14s. Now these are, all right, these are 14 too. These are the Super H points from RWS. I found these work actually really well. So I'm getting half inch to three quarter inch groups at 20 yards with these very, very consistently. So as a, as a basic squirrel gun, rabbit gun, uh, going out in the woods, you know, that's a really good range and this gun will really do well for that. Let's go ahead and shoot a few shots here and we'll just wrap this up. Again, this is a quick look, not a full review. We will get to that later in the season, but I wanted to introduce this to you guys at least because man, I've been sitting on it and we've been waiting to know how the stop shock system really works. Well, since last year. Now, traditionally, you would not want to use maybe sticks directly in contact with the rifle. That's sort of counterintuitive, especially if you're, you know, really steeped in the, the use of the artillery hold. But <clears throat> when you're out in the field, these sticks are really convenient. And when you can use them and make use of them, boy, they do help. So what we want to find out today is, uh, does the stop shocks actually work? Does it help us? And the way I'm gonna test that is I'm gonna find sort of the balance point here on the gun, which is what you'd traditionally do anyway with a brake barrel. And it seems to be right about there, right, right there. Okay, so one, two, three, the third little rib, uh, third little space there is where I'm just gonna let it balance. And we're gonna shoot these RWS Super H points and just let the gun do its thing here. All right, so. Uh, you gotta release the automatic safety. And yeah, I mean, it's super consistent. Let's see here. Very easy to cock. It's got the integrated suppressor, it's got the gas ram. Trigger's not bad, it is somewhat adjustable, but you know, it's not like a fully adjustable match trigger, but it, I don't find the trigger annoying. You know, all in all, I think what you got here is a really decent platform. You know, really very consistent right from the beginning. Uh, the key that I found really was to use those lighter pellets don't try and run super heavy pellets, and then I get some great accuracy. So that's our first look here at the Stop Shock system. 
Uh, this comes in the Umrex throttle right now. I would imagine it's going to come out in some others, but right now, if you get the Umrex throttle, you're going to get the stop shocks, you get the scope, and uh, it's a pretty decent platform. Not real hold sensitive. You know, you can shoot it like this, you can shoot it right off the sticks. The nice thing is that this whole system absorbs that recoil, makes it easier for you to shoot. Now, what do we got going on? Obviously, we got a huge year. Huge, enormous 2017 plan and I uh, can't wait to get into it. Guys, I gotta, get I gotta get ready for shot. Stay with us, we just got a great year. My name is Rick Utzler with Arrogant Web and Arrogant Web TV. Thanks for watching.